I'm Lynn Bassford. I've worked on Hubble for 23 and a half years, and I've been the flight operations manager for the last 10 years. Kind of known here as being a big Hubble fan. <laughs> so it takes up a good portion of my life, and I enjoy it immensely. Hubble is irresistible. Um, it, it, as you said, it's kind of like a friend, but I, I can't help but love the images. And when I walk in my house, I have this big Eagle Nebula on the wall. I have the comet shoemaker Levy hitting Jupiter um, on the wall as well. So it's very irresistible. E ever since um, May of 2011, we've been doing around-the-clock operations with automated command engine. That's the computer software that runs the flight plan that has all the commanding in it to do all the onboard activities. If it sees an issue, it sends out a page alert to us. It comes on our uh, smartphone. A lot of times, in the middle of the night on the weekend. <laughs> We actually have laptops set up at home so that we can log on and we can see what's going on. We probably have real-time telemetry coming in about 95% of the time. And the data, the engineering data, which is our, our telemetry, our voltages, our currents, our temperatures, and that will give us all that health and safety status information that we need. We don't see the final image here. We send it up to John Hopkins Science Institute, and they take it, they process it, and turn it into a picture. Uh, a lot of images are taken over several exposures and then pieced together up at the Institute. There are some that are taken very quickly and very short. It depends on which science instrument you're talking about and what type of filters they're using and what the plan is. So um, there are times where some of the images are taken over days or even weeks and then put together. We see the data the same time everybody across the world sees the image. You know, when it's released, we go, wow, just like everybody else does, how fantastic it is, especially the, the Hubble Deep Field images. It's nice seeing the results of your work. You know.